<laughs> the war between EANC and EDA is serious. Hey, yeah. Now, there was a letter that was sent uh, by EDA to the ANC, and there's a letter that Ramaphosa sent to uh, from local, from his side to the DA, telling them, good day. Hey, fuck off, Nina. Fuck off. Licked letters. Now, you will remember that I've just told you about uh, the fact that the government of national confusion has collapsed. Well, there was a, the, the letter that I'm talking about, the letters that I'm referring to, the one from ETA was um, on the 24th of June, 2024. Uh, says, Dear Mr. C. Ramaphosa, President of the Republic of South Africa, P.O. Box 15, Cape Town, 800. Dear Mr. President, thank you for your hospitality and for the con look, constructive meeting that we, we were able to have today as leaders of our uh, respective parties. I believe that we, look, we are close to a historic deal to form a, cap look, a covenant and a government that will work in the interest of all South Africans. This will enable us to get South Africa into a new trajectory of growth, hope, and opportunity. This is the letter. Uh, this is the letter coming from ETA. But I know at this moment, the letter hasn't said what is going to shock you, but I can guarantee you this letter is going to shock you. Ramaphosa responded, uh, look, after this letter was sent to him, Ramaphosa then responded, his response was, his response was on the 25th. But the letter from DA continued to say, thank you for your hospitality. Okay, we have read that one. Uh, look, it was great. It was a grateful for your uh, look, explanation on how the appointment procedure operate within the government of senior, within the, uh, oh, look, okay, wait, wait, wait. How 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 appointment procedure operate within government at senior official level. I was also encouraged that we could find agreement on how to prevent deadlock between the seven parties at cabinet level by utilizing the mechanism of um uh, consensus, right? As a, as a, as defined in the statement of intent, our look uh, our Parties have both sides. We look forward to further engagement on the aspect once the cabinet has been formed. I would further like to thank you for placing the offer on table on the following cabinet portfolio. This is what the ANC has offered. Him. This is what the ANC has offered EDA. The question is, why the deal hasn't been signed? You ask me. And I'll, I'll say, well, I don't know. But I know you want to know what has been offered. But before we can get to know that, let's know this first. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people. Because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge, and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financially contributing to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the super thanks party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? will bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay 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 uh now i know you said i said i was i, I promise you that i was gonna tell you this this listen listen to what ramaphosa was offering How, that look at the office look at the, the department of home affairs basic education right Trade, industry, and competition, public works and infrastructure. Uh, wait, home affairs, basic education, trade, industry, public works and infrastructure, communications and communication and digital technologies, um, forestry, fishing, and environment, as well as the following uh, deputy ministries. 
finance with full cabinet committee right, energy and electricity, small business and development, and other to place uh, the DTIC. Here there will be the deputies, right? But it doesn't end there. The DA then continued and said the following. As agreed, we have taken this offer back to, look, as agreed, I've taken this offer back to my uh, party for deliberation and discussions and wish to share the feedback. In terms of, uh, of quantum of portfolios, there remain a concern within, within our structure that the DA is sacrificing from our look-in proportional allocation more than the ANC on a pure proportional basis out of out of a cabinet of 30 the DA the DA's share of support within the GNU translate into nine positions rather than six that currently on the table similar we cannot see the relay the 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 relay the the, 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 the relational or uh, uh, for reducing the numbers of DA deputy ministers to only four, logic will dictate that this quantum will be the same or close to the number of cabinet portfolio. Now, there you have it. The DA, they are like, ah, 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 what you are offering on, us on the table, Tina, you are offering us six, Tina, we want nine. Because you must remember our proportional, uh, well, pr proportional this, 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 right? That's what the DA is saying. Hmm. Overall, it is difficult to see how reducing our quantum is a way giving expression to a uh, close 16 of the statement of intent. As it is, as it is in neither re re look up, reflective of the electoral outcome nor the national interest, it is, uh, look, it is going to be extremely difficult to look. It is going to be extremely difficult for me to get my party to accept the third of the ANC's allocation when we won more than half the number of votes of the ANC. However, in terms of the uh, in terms of the quality of portfolio listed above, both cabinet and in terms of deputy ministers, the DA is satisfied that regardless as look regardless this re regards this as serious as, as a serious offer in order to in order therefore to clear the final angle i would like to propose the following two steps this is da for you what is the first step that the addition uh, but in that in addition to the six existing cabinet portfolios which we accept another two portfolios be allocated to the da out of the pro local of the options of sport arts and culture uh, agriculture rural development and land reform or the public service administration right hey they want themselves next to the land yay they said we will also accept the need for public sector wage negotiations to be moved from this portfolio to the minister of finance I am proposing these three options as alternatives to minister in the president. Transport and international relations as I accept your relations for assisting, uh, for assigning these to the ANC. Assigning two of these portfolios to the DA will take our quantum in cabinet from six to eight which will satisfy satisfy our look which will satisfy the satisfy the clause 16 by the by by better reflecting the will of the people as expressed in the electoral outcome while we're also taking into account the national interest now the number two thing that they are looking for they are saying the quantum of deputy ministers from the DA must be similar in must similar be increased right don't worry We'll talk to we'll look into this one. Uh, but in, uh, it, it, it is uh, 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 recurring that we are now close to making the NGU reality. Hi, let's leave this one. It's not important. Uh, I can't find the, 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 this one. Uh, okay. Remember that that letter was written on the 25th of, um, on the 25th, on the 24th of June. The 25th of June. The ANC responded, and when it responded, 
their letter guys is not clear i will run and lie to you but i will try my look my best uh i'll try my best the letter card says dear oh look honorable john stein here's an federal leader democratic alliance p.o box 1475 cape town 800 date 25 june 2024 dear john thank you for the meeting we had yesterday i thought we had a very good constructive discussion following uh, following the, the, the recent exchange of letters between the, the ANC and the TA indicated that you look at that you you did not believe it is a look a proportionate look it is it, it, it is appropriate to negotiate through uh, correspondences the important agreement that the parties to be uh, the statement of intent to form a government of national of national uh, government of national unity are uh, look are trying to put together matter of the national importances such as these are best conducted face to face negotiations and and only when the look when both sides agree that the discussions between them are Re look have reached a level of local maturity advance and should they be reduced to writings uh, to live up to the principle of transparency right that is from the anc uh okay uh whoa it's difficult guys to read to read the letter from the anc because that one is oh that that this letter guys um this letter guys um it's very, very difficult to read, and I'm very, very, I'm finding it very difficult to to to, to read it for you. Uh, okay, but the, the the long and short of it, oh, 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 Ramaphosa then responded there and said that, uh, yeah, man, uh, it's very difficult to read. Eh? It's very difficult to read. Now, okay, but this is the part that I'm going to try and read because it is the most important one. It says, the latest proposal by the DA do not, do not and I'm afraid, align with the principle or principle adopted and, uh, look, and encapsulated in the statement of intent. The way they have been submitted undermines the processes we had committed to following an open, grounded, consti consistent, um, constitutional, compliant, an engagement honoring the, look, the collective understanding of uh, goals to create government or oh, government reflect the will of the people we look at we are unable to look to accede to the da's latest proposal no it's um continuous changing interpretation of the meaning of the statement of intent and moving the goal spot and discussing within the well, look with the da must must therefore start with start with the need for an understanding of the principle embraced by the parties to the statement of intent. Yeah. I am sure that you are aware that the DA is not the only party we are negotiating with on the setting or up of the government of national unity. Following uh, my meeting with you yesterday, we have continued our negotiations with other parties that we wish to that wish to be part of the government of national unity. As the ANC leading the process, these negotiations have, uh, but yeah, I'm not going to go into details about it uh, because it's very difficult to even read the letter, by the way. What I'm getting and what I'm, what I'm getting from this is that the ANC has placed itself in a very unfavorable position. Um, for me, I don't, feel, I, don't, I, I don't feel pity for them because honestly, they've placed themselves in this position. So they will see how they come out of this position. The DA, on the other hand, um there, there, there's something that has been mentioned consistently here and that is the 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 way they interpret the way they interpret things yes um they keep changing their interpretation of this and this the might the, the, they probably would have done it deliberately right they know exactly what they are doing they must have done this deliberately to change the interpretation thereof and say but that's not that, that look actually this is what it means actually no 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 it doesn't mean this actually it means that actually it doesn't mean that it means this actually you know it, it just makes sense of the da right the da has been um bullying in this during these negotiations and really guys it doesn't come as a shock 
But at the same time, you'll ask the ANC, um, you'll ask the ANC, Guti, Beniyapi, Beniyapi. 